everyone today we are going to learn modification of leaves in xerophytic plants like cascoda prickly pear or prickly bubble please look at on your screen about the diagram of prickly pear ya prickly poppy and cascoda how does this plants store and transport food and water to the different part of the plants in cascoda and prickly poppy plants some leaves are modified into spines the spines is help to check out the water from the plant body it also helps to protect the plants and you may have seen in your kitchen garden like garden tea bottle garden please look at on your screen the garden tea and bottle garden these are this uh, garden tea and bottle garden leaves are modified into the thin pore like structure called tendrils this tendrils is help to climb in the plant and you may have seen some plants like onion in onion the leaves play are modified to store the food and it plays and it is becoming fleshy please look at on your screen that onion structures and the leaves are modified into fleshy and you may have also seen that some plants are catch the insects ya trap the insects the plants trap the insects for the need of nitrogen these plants are called insectivorous plants please look at on your screen insectivorous plants like peaches plant and sandy plants now you can see on your screen vegetative propagation by leaf you may have seen that bryophyllum plants and begonia plants these plants are produced by the leaves why do you mean vegetative propagation by the leaves please look at on your screen the definition of vegetative propagation vegetative propagation is the method in the the multiplication of multiplication in the plants where vegetative parts such as root stem leaves give rise to new plants in this method ya vegetative propagation reproductive organs do not take place by this methods and now we can see advantage of vegetative propagation it has several points that one number is that it is an easier rapid and less expenditure of this method two number point seedless plants can be raised third number plants like banana rose banana rose these plants can be raised by this vegetative propagation and by this method that some plants are identical in some cases on the new plants so dear students in this lesson we will learn types of leaves method of leaves and vegetative propagation by leaves and advantages of the leaves